Hi there, it's Kirk Harnack with Telos. You know, early in April of 2014, the Academy of Country Music held their big award show in Las Vegas. In fact, it was at the MGM Grand Hotel. It's a big hoo-ha get-together where all the country stars come out and uh, get awards and do a little entertaining. Here's George Strait. He got Entertainer of the Year. But you know what? Back behind the scenes, there's some engineers to help make it all happen. I'm talking about the Radio Row Engineers. This is a big event, two-day event, when all the country stars come in and interview with lots of radio stations. Well, these engineers from Cumulus and Westwood One uh, helped make that whole thing happen. In the background was this equipment, the infrastructure that made all the Radio Row tables work so easily. In fact, there are about 30 radio row tables here, 30 different radio stations, and the country stars go from table to table to table with their handlers, and they talk to the morning or afternoon DJs from all these radio stations. Now, they all got to use this really cool app from BSI that actually ran some infrastructure in the background. Hey, we're here with Jen at 101.5 in Atlanta, the country station. Hey, Jen. Hi, how's it going? You're here at the ACMs. Tell us about the little audio mixer that you're using when you interview people. This is makes it really easy and it's really cool too. So I've got my microphones here. I can go up and down. This is my mic and my guest mics are all here so I can adjust everyone's levels. Turn them on and off down here and you can start and stop right down here. It makes it really easy. I have no idea how it actually works but that's okay because it works and it works great and it feels really cool. And in your headphones what do you hear? And in my headphones I can hear the station, I can hear myself and I can hear the talk back with my producer back in Atlanta. Oh, okay, so you do both live and recorded stuff here? Yes. Cool. Both live and recorded. It's been awesome. When designing this system, it was really important that the equipment be unobtrusive, out of the way, and that the cabling on the table be just as minimal as possible, just a few mic cables and headphone cables. Here's the app. This is the app that the announcers use to control their own mic levels. They can also flip it to control the level of their mics versus the talkback from their studio back home. Hey, we're here with Stoney Richards at WDSY. <laughs> hey, Stoney. Hey, how you doing? Now, you got this cool little uh, audio mixer here. From a disc jockey's point of view, Tell us what you got. Well, I'll tell you, you know what's interesting about this? It's a it's all in one here, and it's easy to use with your with your hands and fingers, and you just bring the, the, the sound up or down. You turn the mic on or off with a touch of your finger. You might say, well, gee, you can do that anyway, but the fact that this is right here and it's right in front of you, of you makes it very, very convenient. We used to have a box and you had the dials, and we know how to turn dials, but you know what? It's just fun. It's compact. It's easy, and it's got a little, it's got a little stand here, so and it doesn't get in the way of your guests who are sitting across from you, and that's important because you don't have that, you have that feeling of not having wires and all that stuff in front of you. It's really a compact, perfect digital uh, device. And the good thing about it is that it doesn't get in the way of an interview, and if that's what you're doing, that's the thing to have. Now, what Jen and Stoney don't see is the back end. Here are six Axia Studio mix engines that are mixing for 30 radio stations out there on Radio Row. There's also the BSI Skimmer app that's taking care of recording either when they want to or all the time uh, so they catch all their interviews for playback later. Another part of the magic that happens behind the scenes is all the ISDN codecs that are backstage. There's a mix of classic Zephyrs and Zephyr Extremes, some connected through Axia nodes, some connected directly, like the Extremes that have Axia built into them. Another cool aspect of the technology are Telos iPorts. These are IP connected back to Dallas, Texas, to their network production studios. Oh, and these can also carry walkie-talkie audio to and from the uh, MGM Grand in Las Vegas, so they can easily talk with producers and engineers back in Dallas. So back on the show floor now, here's Miranda Lambert just getting done with her interview on Radio Row. Stars are out everywhere, and the disc jockeys from 30 radio stations are all using this great little BSI app and controlling the infrastructure that's already built in to Telos and Axia gear. Simplified wiring, great audio quality, and a great deployment for 30 radio stations. All these things came together because of the BSI app and the Axia infrastructure at the ACM Awards in Las Vegas.